this very fast action. I phoned the city yesterday and told them that the street looked a little rough. And this is what I get today. I guess my tax, my taxes are so high that they listen to me. Of course, there's always got to be one guy doing the work and everybody else standing around. They came and cut the street back in May. So he's working to certain guidelines. And once he gets that done, he'll pack it. And then I guess there'll be some kind of a uh, asphalt guy come. <clears throat> Now he's going to take the stuff that he just broke up out of the hole. Seems to be gathering it into a pile there. He's getting it all in one pile. Now there's going to be a uh, now the truck is bringing in the asphalt. I think here, even before they take away the old stuff, they dump the new stuff all over the road there. I'm assuming that that's the truck that's going to get the uh, old stuff into it. There's got to be at least 10, 10 men total that I see on this operation. Doesn't take them long to get all the big stuff out of the hole. Now you get the little steamroller doing its job. Meanwhile, through the trees, there's a little bobcat that's going to pick up that asphalt when he's finished tamping this down.
Uh, now comes the asphalt. Surprising how many men it takes to do this job. comes the next load of uh, asphalt to go on the asphalt that he just pounded down. Now we're getting part two of the steamroller men coming on top of the uh, second coat of asphalt. Hopefully when it's all done, they, these holes usually sink down a couple of centimeters in time. They settle. So I hope they build it up a little bit above the hole. Hopefully now it's at street level. I've been, in the past I've had to call them back to uh, build it up a little bit. This is all due to a burst water pipe in the road in the middle of winter and they filled it with temporary asphalt. Now this is the permanent job they're doing. That's about it. Just doing some finally tamping down by the curb. I think the head honcho is dressed in black there. He hasn't done much work. He's been supervising. Time for a cigarette now. Job well done.